This guy is turning himself into human shark bait. Get out of the water! Dr. Austin Gallagher went inside a decoy built to look like a whale, then poured blood into the water, then waited to see what happens when a great white attacks. I was definitely scared when the big one showed up. His adventure is documented in a new special, Belly of the Beast Feeding Frenzy, part of Shark Week airing on Discovery. It was so intense. Uh, when it, at one point that huge shark came up and just bit the pectoral fin and I could see right down its stomach. And another shark expert, Paul DeGelda, is diving back into harm's way. It was a little daunting, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, but it was also fun. I find so much fun in the nervousness of not knowing what's gonna happen. DeGelda survived a brutal shark attack caught on this grainy video back in 2009, losing his right forearm and leg. But that hasn't stopped him from heading right back into the warm, shark-infested waters off the coast of Florida. Once in the deep blue, DeGelda releases a red muck, similar to blood, to summon a shiver of bull sharks. The murky red water riles up the sharks, and they are about to go on the attack. You were attacked by a bull shark, correct? Mm, yeah. What was that like for you, being down there with them in those murky waters, the red ink all around you? <laughs> Most people would be pretty triggered by that. I'm not going to lie. The bull sharks are the sharks that I'm least fond of, and whenever they're in the water, I absolutely keep my eyes on them. Shark Week debuts Sunday on the Discovery Channel. Coming up, Loopy after the dentist.